Anaheim sweeps the Calgary Flames. My only question about last night was if you're going to pull Brian Elliott that early in the game, it was on the third shot, the first goal of the game, in the first period. If he's on that short of a leash, I wouldn't have started him. The only that, thing I that would, is my entire the, the, opinion on the, that. The only thing I would say is that I think Glenn Gullitson had a feel for how Elliott has played this year, has watched him play every night, understands if he's in it, understands that tone, understands the body language. You know, the, 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 what, the body language that Brian Elliott had on that first goal, on the Patrick Eves goal where he's saying, how'd that get in, looking down, how'd that get in, mm-hmm. um, to me said, we got to get him out of there. Yeah, I, I, don't, I don't mind the move either. I mean, I, I, to start, uh, to start Elliott, I, I think that he's earned the right. He, he played so well down the stretch, helped them get into that final playoff spot. And I think... You know, that was a really short leash that he did have on. I'm sure Brian It's got to be close to a record, yeah. doesn't it? I, it, it I does. would love to know but, if there's a goal you've been pulled in a playoff yeah. game sooner than that. The, the I'm going to take a wild guess and say, well, no. Mike Keenan, who's in China right now, we <laughs> can't talk to, who's done it. The, the, <laughs> o- the only thing that, that I don't like about it, and I've been on the bench when this has happened, when a leaky goal goes like in like that, like you said, and you didn't start, the, maybe, maybe Chad Johnson gets a start. If you didn't start him, all of a sudden the mentality of the players on the bench, you're kind of like, oh, my goodness, here now, we go again. And it plays with your mind. So if you leave him in, I think it's, it doesn't affect you to, as much. To that point, would a player ever see that goal and, and blurt something out? Oh, yeah, I think so. I have <laughs> and on the bench. Say, oh my! Yep. I mean, and it wouldn't be that polite. No, no, hundred percent. That that happens all the time, no. and I don't know if that happened last no, night. No, neither do I. But I think Glenn Gullickson had it in his head. If there's any a moment that he sees any sort of struggle, yeah. he's going to get yanked. And to your point, Darren, you know maybe the right might, right move was just to start Chad Johnson. But I think out of pure respect and what Brian Elliott has done all year, there's no time he had for to respect. Get but here's yeah, but he could have got well, the so, so the that, respect is saying you know what you've 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 played well the back half of the year. Hasn't gone our way through three games. We're going to give yeah, the other guys. Hey, listen, I, I'd be more concerned about where Johnny Goudreau was in this series. Yeah, he was he was absent. I'd be I'd uh, you know I mean, I think if if I mean they only allowed two goals last night, Darren. Really, it was a two goal game. I mean, they, uh, you know, if you can't score two uh, two goals at least to get it to overtime or three to win, you know, you got a problem. Mm-hmm. You've got a problem. And where was the goal screen? Sean Monahan. He was great. All series yeah. on the power play, doing his job, going to the dirty spots. You know, I, they're def- I mean, I, st- I mean that Giordano is a warrior in my mind. But I'll tell you what, some guys didn't show up. Some guys didn't show up, and, and thirteen was at the top of the no show list. To finish the thought on Elliot Johnson, you make that change early, I guess, because. Johnson doesn't sit in the bench for another five, six, seven minutes. He gets right into the game. He's basically had the same amount of time coming off warm up as, yeah, as Elliot. I, 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 I don't, I don't, I don't know. know. It just it just seemed odd. If you're going to start him, give him give him a couple of goals. But I mean, but here's the one thing. I mean, I think when you're let's see what's the what, when you're 90 feet away from a guy, when you're sitting on the bench 90 feet away from a guy, you can tell. I think Gullitson knew right away. He doesn't have it. He doesn't have it. I don't know what you're and, thinking, and you're three feet away. <laughs> I've got it, man. And, and <laughs> when, when, you, when you saw him, when he, when he talked post game too, it, yeah. it was, I mean, what are you going to be, sour grapes? He was very, he's politically right, but I didn't see that real pissed off attitude. I'm like, I can't believe he got. He, he had it, some time to. He, a little bit. Over. Yeah, of course, of course. But I, it was Chad Johnson the guy. Like, if it, was it that big of a thing that, you know, he's going to make the biggest difference? I think that's the reason why Elliot got the start. It wasn't like. Chad Johnson was going to go in and just shun, uh, stun the world. But I just, I don't know. I think they gave him the benefit of the doubt because of what he's done for the entire season. By the way, I think Chad Johnson's back there next year. I don't think Brian Ke- Elliott is. He's a Calgary is. kid, is he not? Calgary kid. Yeah, he'll, he'll be, be there. I think, you know, he'll, they'll give him, they might give him a three-year deal at $2 million a year, and he'll be that quality backup that he was for them all season long. And the, the other thing to remember in the Johnson s- situation, remember, if he had not been injured, Late in the season, might that have changed the personality of him starting last night? Because I'm not sure he was even a, you know 100 until game three or four. Some credit should also go to the Anaheim Ducks. Who, oh, they uh, were good. Who, 